Yay! Legend of Grimrock 2, the custom dungeon, Hrothgar. Now when you get onto a certain stage of this mission, what is the stage of the mission? Blink it out, you're having a laugh! Six and a half hours? Wow! Right, when you've got six and a half hours on the clock, <laughs> one, two, we've got three rapiers. As soon as you've got two, then you can go onto the arena. It's quite a time consuming and uh, big old effort. Uh, but it's, it's worth it, it's worth it. But you do come across these turtles. Um, so maybe uh, sling in a couple of turtle slices for your adventure. Actually, we already found another rapier, to be fair. And we already put it into the entrance to the arena. So this kind of fella here is if you if you take it away, then the entrance closes. So you can't really take it away. So we're not going to take it away. We are going to go around. To, the entrance is marked by some vine. Here it is. Vine number one. Vine number two. And then you go through and you follow this dodgy grass. Have you ever seen dodgy grass? And you get another rapier. Ah! put that in and then the whole thing kicks off so now we are into arena territory this is arena number one and this bit here is where you came in as a guest you can do the little guest tour uh, and here is your welcome party mr wyvern has attended personally to your needs likes to see every visitor personally so there you go yes it's a good old game starts off fairly mellow you know gathers pace Sometimes you can actually get away with kipping, sometimes you can't. This uh, Murgatroyd has got to go up on um, what about armor. Good. If it all comes to a halt and you think, what's going on now, then that's probably the time to look and see whether you missed something. Uh, Fantastic shield, I love 
that. That's good. Uh, so if everything just comes to a halt, there's probably a reason. Um, probably in your interest to have a look around. Oh, there you go. Look, this is what I mean. This is what I mean. So you have a look around at the ladders, see where they are. Lead to various places where you can get food, for instance, if you want to. Oh, look. You can jump down on that git. Uh, now to save the game. I'm not really sure about taking this woman on. Uh, there's no easy answer is there? I can't jump down with her I don't think. And she won't be frozen. So probably speed potions are rage potions. We'll just take her from the front. I know it's uh, not very easy. Subtle strategy. Speed potions, rage potions. Take her out that way. There you go. That, flipping it, that didn't take long, did it? Wow. Um, so this leads to. Where does this lead to? The next. No, it doesn't do that. Uh, he's complaining. Oh, this leads to. Yeah. Look. This is where this leads to. Go up here. What happened? <laughs> that is how you start the next level of wave. You just jump down. Definitely jump down like that. You don't actually have to kill anything, just land. Um, that's good enough. Can't really afford to lose anybody, I don't think. Oh, we've got a return potion, haven't we? Yeah, but he's going for him now. The team are in pretty good nick. So this is um, arena number two, is it? Yeah, arena number two this is. going up. I think he's right up on firearms now. Yeah, he is. 
is he? Although the bow and arrow is a pretty good uh, kit. Mighty old sword there, that's for sure. When it connects, it's pretty impressive. It really is. Uh, oh, it's food all over the show. They're getting a bit hungry by the look of it. Oh, hold on. That wasn't very friendly, was it? Have a sleep if possible. Would be great, wouldn't it? Cool, that was cheeky, wouldn't it? Well, that's an acceleroid. Without a doubt. easy to take out these bumblebees if you freeze them. I know it costs a frost bomb but damn good idea. Oh it's those Medusas. It is too. Look at flipping shadow there. Blimey, that was lucky. A couple of Medusas and this team are not phased. They're just not phased. So you can chance it having a sleep every now and again if you want to. Um, and we are arena number two of how many arenas? At least four. I think there's five. Probably six actually. But around in this level. Oh, this is open. This is open. Back in business. Right, this goes up. Oh, you can leave now if you want to. You can tell I've had enough of all this. So I want to do something else. So you can. This is your exit back to civilization. So here you are, back in the old crypt. Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? Look at that. Hmm. The remains of the passed away adventurers. This is where the champions get deposited. When. I finished their adventures and they're sick of it all. So we're back onto the arena. The arena resumes. So you can go down, say for instance you want to plunder some of these. Get some of these bombs. You are welcome to do so at any point. But where do you go on for the next arena? There is a place to go. Oh, we're on to arena 3 of course. This is arena 3. Look, you pull this lever to exit. So don't pull the lever and the exit won't open. If you pull the lever, the exit opens and then you have to leave by the exit because this lock just switches off. That's like an off button. If you don't pull the lever, then this lock will... Here we go. This is number three. 
One, two, three. It's the biggest of the lot. Uh, is there a wizard in this lot? Or is that the last one? As long as there's no one in there. Oh yeah, this is where the skeleton commander is in there. You've got to be ready for that. In fact, we're not ready, are we? She's got no rage. She has got no... He's got nothing either. I wonder if we can make some up. Ratmaster, can you do some? Oh, we can do some on the fly, look. Oh, blinking egg. Look at this lot. Come on then. I'm only thinking of the skeleton commander, that's all. Um, but so we could also... Long, I think they're all flipping coming out now. Um, where's that wyvern? It's not a wyvern. Blimey, there's tons of them. potion. He's got a speed potion and two rage. Oh, we're looking good. We're looking good. save it because the skeleton commander is coming out any time at which point it goes totally ballistic I mean it's all quite tame stuff at the moment any minute I'm going to have this geezer come out it's going completely flipping if you haven't saved it for a while you could lose it at that point quite easily so it's a good idea Many of these about. Oh, it was a zero. That was a zero on that one. Oh, that's better. You can't. Um, oh, another one of these wyverns. Oh, we've got quite a few. Oh, finished off with the old ancient claymore. Oh my god, look who's come out. Look who's come out, Uncle Tom Cobbley. Oh no. Look at awesome threesome. Oh, we've got the ladder. We've got the ladder. Right. Oh, blimey. Countryside world. Blimey, 
is all. He is all. Come this way! Come this way you git! Oh no he's not now. He's not coming this way. Not after that. Uh, he's got the like, oh blind. Oh there he is there. Stones! It's those stones that finally did it! Well done Ratmaster! He's finally he got we got a gear key and we got an iron key out of that. Actually, what happened to his minions? So he didn't did they attack? Didn't really notice them attacking. They, they did a miserable job of defending him, I've got to say. That was absolutely flipping hopeless. How many minions did he have? Just one. That was horrendous, wasn't it? That was absolutely terrible, the way they tried to defend him. Uh, oh. Well, okay. We're back to here. Back to this place. Where are we supposed to go? Where are we supposed to go? We've come to a kind of an impasse. It's a mystery. He's going up. Or what? What's he going up on? Uh, critical? I don't know. Does that work on a sorcerer? So we got all this way. What does it mean? This is the arena that we. <laughs> it does look incredible. It does look amazing. That is the uh, garden restaurant that you can go to. 
have a nice cup of tea up there. Sit back, enjoy the old uh, butterflies and everything in there. It'd be absolutely wonderful. Oh, of course. This is the way that you go to the next. This is the way you go to the next flipping arena, isn't it? We go down here. There you do. Uh, definitely do. What? Uh, this is this is all the ones that we just done. Another rapier, just sitting there, just sitting there waiting for us. Wow! How about that? We just found it. Just found it in there, just there, waiting for us. <laughs> oh, I tell you what, you can't help but uh, think. The stuff is just there. Wait a minute, what happened to the? What the hell happened to all our arrows? This bloke. Oh, he's got eight arrows. He's picked them all up, has he? Okay. Well, eight arrows isn't much. Oh, here's that flipping other minion that flipping ran off for the first sign of flipping trouble. You didn't defend your master, did you? It's you. What, let him die. Git. You should get the medal of cowardice. Um, wait a minute. He's got four. She's got three. Oh no, he hasn't got enough. Ratmaster, he hasn't got enough. Don't let a few more to the mine at all. Um, he's got that. Uh, wait a minute, he's got one rage. She's got one rage. He's got four of those. She hasn't really got enough. Oh, they're looking, they're looking pretty good. They've got three rapiers. That's brilliant. That is brilliant. Uh, okay. He can go back to his nine arrows. He can actually have a kip. He can do a save. So we got to area. We've got are arena three sorted. Uh, now we're going to go on to the next one. Oh, the next one's with, with an actual wizard. The next one. Right, so now we're at, this is Arena 4 now. You can choose any of these characters. If you jump down on any of them, that starts the next arena off. It's as simple as that. jump down on any of these inhabitants and that will just kick off the whole thing so you can choose you can choose any of these inhabitants at all and that'll do it or I think you can actually exit or you can get the shotgun you could get the shotgun this is your prize Hey, you need to be Firearms 4. Sorry, mate. You are Firearms 3. You need to go up one more notch. Look, it's Firearms 4 and you can use that. Alright? That's the exit. Um, I don't think we actually need that, to be honest. I mean, it is a lovely orb. It's an absolutely gorgeous orb, that is. But, the trouble is got that ladder and over where the shotgun was found you can actually exit but we're actually thinking about doing the next arena so should you wish to do the next arena you just choose one of these this one for instance but that kicks off the next arena that signals oh you can still exit you can still exit because you can go out that way look um, there's still an outer for you but it's timed I'll just show you the outer if you go on the exit, see now you're saying goodbye to this lot. 
So you you have said goodbye. Uh, so at this point, you can actually use the exit routes and say, I've had enough of all this lot. I'm going to go back to the main constituent parts. So you, you this is your exit route out of here. So you can just say, ta-ta, I am going. At which point you end up here. Um, looks very interesting, but basically, is this teleporter one? Teleporter room one? It is, isn't it? Yeah, you're back to the very start of the game, really. So you can ex exit that uh, place many, many ways. But I tell you what, we are going to fight on. We are going to fight on because we're in good spirits, you know, we're in good fettle. Hmm. We can do it. We're onto the last arena on this level, I think it is, or is there one more? Uh, could be one more. Uh, but there's this This one's the one with the wizard. Uh, okay, so we're back. So if you go through there and up there, you're, you're, you're signalling that you're going out. Um, if you don't, it's timed. At any minute now, that thing's going to come down, and that means you you decided that you weren't going to exit, at which point it really does start. Okay, so now it's started because you didn't take your chance to leave. Here he is, look, this is an actual wizard, this is not a clone. This is an actual wizard and uh, they are completely different to the clones in that they are fantastically better at defending themselves. You know, you can chuck a frost bomb at a clone and the chances are that will be the end because they just you just, just chop them down after that. But that probably won't flipping work with... Oh! Ah! Oh right, okay, so the party has to just tread on these plates. It seems quite uh, a juvenile thing, but there you go. Oh, it's gathering pace. It's definitely gathering pace. Blimey. We're queuing up now. Blimey, they're coming out a million times a flipping second now. Uh... I think it's probably a good idea to thing. Oh, God, you're joking. How did he find me so quick? How the hell did he find me so quick? Oh, he's going in there, is he? Bastard. Where the heck did that toad descend to? Got half of our stuff, for God's sake.
Oh, he didn't like the poison, did he? He didn't like the poison. He, he's quite good on paralysing this gits. He really is good. Blimey, I mean, that was a frantic little bit of flipping. So we got everything back, which is flipping. That was a bit of a trio triage there. Um, going to be a tricky git when he comes out. He's the full Monty. Oh, we've got this. We've got this. He was uh, quite a colourful character, but uh, their weakness is being jumped on, isn't it? Quite obviously. Hello. Hello. Started at one, two, three, four. We're on four, and that wizard comes out last. You don't have to take him down to complete the uh, the mission. In fact, I think we might have done it now. I think it might have. I think we might have completed it now. What do you think? Well, there's another ladder here. Ah, where does this go? Ah, oh, this is great. This is so good. Cool. I'll tell you what we could do with a refill. No, this is good. I love this bit. This is so good. Uh, yeah, you need a bit of faith on this one. It's a lovely little puzzle. On this. Oh, we've reached the end. Okay. I wouldn't jump in there if I was you. Um, it's just that um, it just you know you then can't get back. That's the only problem. Um. Anyway, what you do is. Ponce along to here, and you see that sack there and everything. You think to yourself, "Oh, I don't know." Well, obviously, the first thing you do is save it in case it doesn't work. <laughs> but then you can just walk across, grab it, and this as well, and you're back on terra firma. See, you just need a bit of faith. I, I've got to admit, I couldn't really um, take that for granted without saving it. But uh, just do a save, and then you can just go and do it. Um, just pop along there, grab it from the uh, cage. And these are absolutely it's amazing. You think these are just used for energy, but in fact, later on, they are frost bombs. That's what they are. So we have got the most amazing... Oh, blimey, there's more too. These as well. Um... So, look at that. That's really a change in fortune. She's got four, five, three. He could really do with some of these. He could do, really do with a couple of these blue ones, really. They're quite... But, on the other hand... He's, you get three frost bombs now. For the price of two. But he really needs these blue ones. That's the only thing. Um... So he's got one rage, she's got one rage, that's probably enough. We've still got three rapiers, brilliant! Uh, he can't take it, he just can't take it. He can't take it. Mind you, I don't know why he's got that gear key, particularly. Uh, let's
let's put it in its rightful place, which is there. Uh, she's got two sacks. What the heck is all this? Oh. Oh, well. Oh, it's a full bag of food there. This is all odds and sods. Uh, so's that by the look of it. We are going to have to have a sort out back at the old flipping blue snakes. I can see that. Right, well, we've done some fantastic foraging. That was definitely worth coming up for. Without a doubt. That was so good. Um, blimey, that was good. And Mr. Gitface is still in his cage. What is it that makes him come out then? I don't know. We haven't done something. Something hasn't gone right. We've got we've got something that we haven't done. No. I don't know what it's waiting for. It's waiting for something. Maybe it's just time. Oh, there's another ladder. Well, this is what it's waiting for. This is what it's waiting for. Uh, we've got a red gem. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Uh, there's some fantastic heavy armour here. Absolutely gorgeous. In a barracks. Well, some fantastic stuff, all right. Recharge. Icon. Um, cannonballs, which you might collect or you might not. I don't know. Um, Arrows? Cool, that's a flipping welcome. The definite. Um, oh, that's a brilliant shield, isn't it? That really is. Yeah, it's a fantastic shield. Too much. He hasn't got a shield, though, has he? The only thing is overweight now. Uh, bullets. So does that mean? And we've got there's t tons of armor up there. Uh, what does this mean? Does that mean Uncle oh that wizard's out? In fact, not only is the wizard out, but there are various other creatures that have uh, come out. Um, I've tried frost bombs on that wizard before, it's just a flipping waste of time. If you can freeze him. See, he's got his shield on, he's got his shield on. Oh my god. I don't know whether it's any good going up here. Blimey, hello. He won't be frozen. Doesn't work. Doesn't work. He's not like a clone. He's definitely not like a clone. Oh, 
Oh, there's um, there is something in his cell, in his cage. There's a lock, isn't there? If you've got the key to it, you can set off ancient defences. Um, I do know that. I think that we've actually done enough at this point to actually leave this bit and move on to the next one, I think. Where is his cell? Oh, you have got the... We have got the skull key, haven't we? We've got it, haven't we? I've got a feeling we've actually got that one. Yeah, we got it. Okay, well, we just saved it. So let's try it. Right, here's the ancient defences happening, look. They're happening. Well, I suppose we can use them on the flipping ogre if nothing else. Those defences stopped. Um, oh, this is open. This is open. Right, right, right. Okay, so now we, that closes down to signify that you have left the building. The party... Oh, we got another one of these back. That's quite handy. So, you've done your bit, sort of thing. Unless you've got one of these. In which case, we've got plenty. We've got three of these. So, we've got these all right. Uh, go back to one of those previous loads. Where did we go back to? Uh, let's go back to this one. Anyway, we're back to this. Oh, well, I mean that was a, quite a high cost. Oh, 
no, the sword's gone. The sword's gone, charming. Anyway. Stones. I'm supposed to go on there. Um, God, we've got so much stuff. We, where does this go down to? Oh, of course, it goes down to here. You need to put in another rapier sword, which we just happen to have. Oh, we are going down. Oh, the next flipping arena. Look at this. We have arrived at the next arena. There you go. And here's the bright one. This is what we're looking for. See that mess on the floor? This is what we're looking for. Um, so, what you do is, you just pick some sort of object, place it through the actual grating. He comes out, you let him out. And then, what you want to do is to take yourself in there, because there's a lever. So before you pull it, uh, the lovely shadow is going to go up on, um, basically, critical. Then you pull the lever, grab this again, it's all highly scientific. In here there's a secret button. There's a secret button just there. Oh yeah, of course, over the back here. I've got a feeling there are some secret areas. It just goes on and on. How many how many hours have we done now? Let's check the old stats. Seven hours now. Seven hours on the old legend of Grimrock 2. So the next stage on this is to press the button. So the button opens, this opens, but at the same time, this lot come out. Blimey, he got taken out with a stone. Go back to the arrows. Eight arrows, come on. Oh, there's the other lever, isn't there? There's another lever to pull. Oh, they're quite good. Quarrels. Um, what about a cloak? No, they don't need cloaks. They don't need cannonballs. So, 
uh, the next thing to do is to pull the other lever. There's another lever down here. So you go back in here, usual procedure. Now it's the other, the other lever's frenetic, isn't it? See, that's slow. This is fast. So now is the time to have a rest. Um, and save it again. That's it. We are on an arena special. That's it. Right, now you pull that one. See, now it starts going a bit berserk. Definitely does. Oh no, we used all our frost bombs, bombs up. How could we do that? Listen, it can do that. Oh, a whole lot of them have come out. Oh, I th we got up the ladder, didn't we? We just got up the ladder. I nearly forgot. You don't have to fight them. You don't have to fight them. Oh, that is really cheeky, isn't it? That is really cheeky. You don't have to fight them. You can do if you want to. <laughs> but the worst thing you can do there is let them surround you. If you don't let them surround you, that's crazy. Uh, if you go up the ladder, I totally forgot. Oh my god, he's completely ferocious, this one. Hello. Hello. He's a git. That's the way to do it. It is the way to do it. We might have penned ourselves into a corner now, I don't know. Ah, there you go, we're alright. We're alright. So, you can fight them, or you can leave them to their own devices. So, on there, there's some mighty great ar armament, but um, even more important is there's a gap up here, look. These are the clues. Um, in fact, there's, a be there's even more of a clue here, look. These paintings and this mess is kind of telling you to move forward into here. So you get these, and you get that, even better. Then you've got this young lady. The guardian of the outer back office, as she likes to be known. Definitely go for a definite kip now. Ooh, who's got loads of food? Uh, she has. So now, where are we now then? Where is this place? Well, this is teleporter room three. So this is how you get to teleporter room three. Oh, blimey, look at that. This is the collection which we've already got. Uh, oh no, we haven't, have we? We lost it. I don't know where it went. Oh, so that's nice to have that back. Blimey, I tell you what, we take those because um, you do lose these items. Sadly, you do lose these items in the game. Probably lost it to a git like him, to be fair. So we have just conquered arena number five, I think it is, yeah, number five. The place is completely deserted. We sorted it. Can't do much better than that. Wow. Oh, 
Oh, there's this other place, isn't there? This is another secret place you can go into. Well, let's recharge. Oh, well, very nice too. So what do we do now? Oh, we've got teleporter th room three, haven't we? This is teleporter room three here that we're looking at. Um, this is it here. Um, it is worth going all the way round. Look. Green. Blue. Red. And that is talking about... Um, these things. We've got green and red, but no blue. We need red, green, and when that happens, this trapdoor opens. When you put those, when you put those gems in to these locks, there it's asking for gems. Red, blue. When it's asked, it's asking for those things, and we don't have the blue. We, I know we've got this thing, but it's not a blue gem. So at the moment you've got a choice of oh, have we been here before? I think we might have been here before with that trapdoor open. I've got a feeling we we did. So now it's just a case of choosing a teleporter and moving on. I mean it's always best to just do a save and see what happens. So we're just gonna try this one at random. <laughs> oh, this is a rerun. This is a rerun. That is fantastic. That's flipping brilliant, that is. Oh, yeah, and the trigger is this green one. If you decide that you're going to take this green one on, then it starts. If you don't, then it doesn't start. It's waiting for you to attack that green one. 